I hate talking into cameras. I'm Ellie. I live in Sydney. But I wasn't born here. I was born in New Zealand. I married an Australian, so now I'm stuck. I'm an artist. I wasn't educated in art. I have a Bachelor of Science in Earth and Environmental Sciences. I kind of wanted to look after trees. This is my tidy desk. That's probably the tidiest that it ever gets. I should have written a script. That was what I should have done. Hi. Let me just show you some of my journals. Maybe that will explain some of what I am failing to. So I don't really know if I have an art style. Certainly my illustrations are a little bit more cohesive in style than my art journaling. And I kind of like it that way. Like I just kind of do what I feel at the time. When I was 16, we moved to this country from New Zealand. I really struggled with that and I made this journal where I kept a whole lot of things that people had sent me and poems about the things that I was going through and a lot of art, so much art. Things that I found and stuck in and it was so important for me to do that. Going through that period of time and working through those things made me understand and start to appreciate how important art was to me and I had always drawn, always. Drawing is just something that I do and have always loved. It's me, look, I had blonde hair. And that's me. See, I've always liked drawing. That's baby Ellie. It wasn't until I was in my 20s uh, where I really had to test that. I was diagnosed with bipolar. And being in the middle of a manic episode in Taiwan it was pretty confronting. I hadn't been doing a lot of art up until that point. I really had to lean in to kind of process the emotions that I was going through. And it's hard when, when you're going through something to know how to articulate those feelings because you've never really felt them before or never had to address them. And I found that true of a lot of these wonderful first time challenges is that you've never had to talk about this kind of grief before. You've never had to talk about this specific challenge and art journaling and writing them down and practicing and then trying to express things even without using words is amazing at helping you to communicate with other people about these things. It's something that I rely on when new challenges come. So last year, last year I was diagnosed with cancer. Just out of the blue, it was kind of sucked. There are just things that you have to address and art journaling is such a wonderful and available and accessible tool. So, so I like it for those reasons but I also like it just because it gives me time to play with my paints. So yeah. That's my hero, Commander Shepard, Mass Effect fans. My Shepard was blonde. And she wore black lipstick, it was empowering.